Hi, I'm Tony from Tech Support Department and this week's tip is going to be about uh, remote support assistance. Okay, I'm going to show you how to connect with us remotely. Uh, let's say ZoomText is uh, uh, still up and running. You can open the help menu on the ZoomText and go down and select Tech Support. It opens our Tech Support window where we have a Fixit command box and you can type the command there. Uh, if you type help, H-E-L-P, help, and simply press enter, that directly takes you to the website where you would have the representative that's available. Uh, right now I'm logged in. Uh, I'm number three, support representative Tony. And if you just click on me, and uh, you're prompted to either run a file or save it, uh, this time it says save file, so I'll choose save file. And it's a pretty small file, so it should be quick to uh, download and save. Uh, in Firefox, it puts it at the top of the list of downloads. Uh, simply there, you can just press enter, and it, you get prompted with a run prompt, uh, or a, a box that you click run on it. And in a minute, um, it will load and I will have control of your computer. Okay, let's say that uh, you've got a problem with ZoomText and ZoomText actually is not running uh, and it has an issue and you're with us on the phone trying to help you out. What you would do is you would open your uh, internet browser um, and you would go to our website. So I'll do that. Go to aisquared.com and you on our website you would select support from the tabs on the top there you would go to support and then you could look on the left side if you want and the second link there link there says remote support you can click on that or if you scroll down a tiny bit there's a section that says remote control support and basically all of these links will take you to the same place even the picture of the remote will also take you to our remote page and once I click on it immediately takes me to there where you'd see me or whoever you were speaking with on the phone uh, listed there so uh, support representative Tony I'll click on that and I'm prompted either to run the file or save it so you can either click run or save in this case because I only have that choice so I'll save it so now I'll show you what happens on my computer. Okay, now on my computer here, uh, tech support, this is what I will see. And I'll see your computer listed up here. And I will uh, go ahead and select it and say, uh, give me access. And this is basically all I see of your computer. And I can control it from here. And uh, notice that even though ZoomText is magnifying on your computer, I don't see any magnification, it's pretty small, even though it says here 3x, it's uh, no magnification whatsoever. Uh, even if we turn on color enhancements, I don't see it at all either. But I'll be able to um, go in and fix ZoomText for you and help you out. And that's this week's ZoomText tip.